you need first amine and diazonium salt. I am Sagar Vasanaradan Pure, MSc, NET, GATE, Assistant Professor, Sadhguru Gadge Maharaj College, Karad, Autonomous. So, num lecture number three reactions of amines. In that, first, carbile amine reaction. When primary amine react with chloroform and potassium hydroxide in presence of heating condition to give, give isocyanide. The secondary amine and tertiary amine do not give the carbile amines. That is, this reaction only one gives the primary amine. Okay, remember it. So, this reaction to distinguish primary amine from secondary and tertiary amine. Okay, so see the reaction. Here take aniline plus here chloroform and hydroxide, potassium hydroxide, 3 mole of KOH used in heating condition. Okay, so this is a symbol of heating. Then to form N double bond C, that is isocyanide is bind with the or joined to the phenyl ring so name is phenyl isocyanide or phenyl isonitrite plus 3 mole of KCl plus 3 mole of water okay so this reaction only one gives the oh, primary amine okay then second one is scouton bowman reaction Aniline react with benzyl chloride in presence of cold 10% NaOH to form N phenyl benzamine. That is, this reaction in basic condition. Okay. When aniline react with benzyl chloride to form benza, phenyl benzamine. So, here take aniline plus benzoyl chloride. This is the structure of benzoyl chloride. Okay. In presence of 10% uh, cold NOH. Okay. So take 10% KOH. Then to form uh, this is phenyl benzamine. Okay. Well, what is the byproduct of this reaction? Uh, so here is yes, here is a byproduct of reaction. Okay. So this is a second reaction of amine. Then third reaction, electrophilic substitution reaction. Okay, here you take aniline as an example, aromatic amines. Okay, so aniline being aromatic amine. Okay, so is a bifunction. Why are bifunction? Because or due to amino group and aromatic ring. Okay, so aniline heavy basic in nature. Okay, because NH2 group here present. Okay, and NH2 group is joined to the aromatic ring. Okay, so basic nature of amino group and aromatic, so it is the aromatic amines. Then phenyl group exert inductive, negative inductive effect due to or to lower the basic nature of amine group. Okay, so the basic nature of NNA is decreases because NH2 group is joined to the phenyl group and this phenyl group act as a negative inductive group. So negative inductive effect to decrease the basicity of amine and phenyl group act as a uh, or phenyl group uh, group exert is a minus inductive effect. So to decrease the basicity. Okay, so then amino group being electron releasing electron releasing activate the benzene ring for electrophilic attack. Means this amino group donate the electron density to benzene ring. So this benzene ring to, to electron rich. So attack to the electrophile. Okay. So this reaction to substitute the electrophilic. Okay. Means electrophilic substitution to the benzene ring. For which position is more active? the direct electrophilic reaction goes to the ortho and para position. Okay, 
remembering it once again the reaction or incoming electrophile always goes to the ortho and para position okay understand the reaction or here resonance of nlm see that resonance structure of aniline okay see here resonance structure of aniline this nh2 group donate the electron density to the benzene ring so this double bond break and this ortho position get negative this arrow to indicate the resonance structure this structure is a, is converted to this one okay see this nh2 group donate the electron density so it get the positive charge this ortho position donate the electron density in this position and this bond break to form the para position negative charge this para position here donate the electron density this bond break this ortho position get negative charge and last one this negative charge donate the electron density this position and reverse to the this positive and this arrow get negative to neutralize the positive negative arrow and lone pair here uh, uh, re uh, reappear okay so resonance structure of aniline mm, is high okay very simple please practice to do it then first reaction is nitrogen okay so resonance in resonance structure ortho and para position is electron rich in nitration reaction to direct nitration of aniline to forms the oxidized product of tar okay so do not directly nitration in aniline so it step wise follow okay so the nitration of amino group is protected by first acyl or acetyl chloride to convert to the amide by acylation okay means why are why are this required because do not directly nitration so we're step by step follow okay so nitration of amino group first to convert the amide by process of acylation so in that process to deactivate the ring okay with this aromatic ring to deactivate okay then amino group get nitrate to form nitration okay at the end the hydrolysis this amino group is convert to into amine group okay so see the reaction okay this aniline react with this acetyl chloride to formation of acetaldehyde okay that is formation of acetaldehyde then this process is acylation after that to get nitration of acetaldehyde so it gives the ortho and para product but major product is a para nitro okay so it this product get hydrolyzed by using the water okay so hydrolytic condition this amide is hydrolyzed and re amide group is region convert to the amine group okay so this is this is a nitration so it product is mono nitration okay then second bromination the halogenation of aniline occurs to form polysubstituted product okay means halogenation means bromination chlorination iodination okay but always here bromination of aniline occurs to form polysubstituted product okay so when aniline is treated with or react with excess bromine water to form tri bromo aniline this product is polysubstituted okay why are polysubstituted because excess bromine water used so here in this structure is aniline 
react with bromine water okay that is bromination process so formation of uh, this product so here ortho here para and here ortho okay so three hydrogen atom is substituted by bromine group that is substitution reaction okay so what is the name of this product tri bromo nad okay this product is polysubstituted if you require mono substituted then to goes to the this reaction okay mono substituted product. how to prepare the mono substituted product this reaction and uh, is like to the nitration type of reaction okay so first to deactivate the aniline okay how to deactivate aniline to by the acylation process okay acylation of amino group second then second process is halogenation halogenation okay that is bromination and third hydrolysis to give bromo to para bromo aniline means this amide group is converted to the uh, amine group by using hydrolysis process see the reaction aniline then here you use acetic anhydride pyridine or other other reagent used last time the reagent which used the acyl chloride also used then formation of acetanilide okay acetanilide here used the second step is a halogenation so here use halogenation is bromine water okay br2 then para bromo is a major product ortho bromo is prepared but para bromo product is a major product after that this amide is hydrolyzed by using h plus or water molecule so this amide group is converted into amine group then formation of product is Four bromo aniline. Okay, this is a mono substituted bromo product. Then last reaction is sulfonation. So the aniline react with dilute sulfuric acid to form sulfenic acid. Sulfenic acid. So this reaction aniline react with H2SO4. Sulfonation process. This is a product. Sulfenyl acid. Okay, means aniline react with dilute sulfuric acid to form sulfenyl acid. Okay, thank you.